Hello everyone. It's an honor to speak with you, the Coalition of Black Trade Unionists, especially now, at a time when we have so much to celebrate as Kentuckians. We've reached a historic moment, one where Kentucky is a national economic leader, with our great unions and workforce leading the way. We're bringing in record-breaking investments, and these projects are creating new, good-paying jobs for our people. The work we are doing together lets people across the world know that we here in Kentucky get things done. Together, we're doing things that others said weren't possible, and we're proving them wrong time and time again. We've landed record-breaking investments, including the two largest projects in the history of our state that have solidified us as the electric vehicle battery production capital of the United States of America. During my administration, we've announced more than 880 private sector new location and expansion projects totaling $27 billion in investments. Even better, we've created more than 47,500 new private sector jobs. Across Kentucky, we are seeing amazing things happening. Historic milestones, including the most jobs filled in Kentucky's history, the second and third best years for new wages. We've also lowered income and property taxes and secured the largest surpluses and rainy day fund in Kentucky's history. But the great news is we're just getting started because we're going to make sure these four years of progress turn into decades of prosperity for every single Kentucky family. Because we're committed to making sure that the future is bright for every family, not just the lucky few. And thanks to you, we are seeing that vision through. We are continuing to move Kentucky, not right, not left, but forward. And as we do that, we know that our unions are the very backbone of our economy. Unions help build this great nation. Your work created the middle class and still today you fight for a better life, better wages, better benefits, better safety, better everything for every family across America and right here in Kentucky. So I'm grateful and I will always stand with you and support your efforts. That's why I took action in March 2022 to veto House Bill 4, which reduced unemployment benefits. It's also why I signed House Bill 146 into law last March, which extended the number of weeks for UI benefits. As long as I'm your governor, these kind of moves will be met head on and your interests will be protected. Scripture says, therefore, encourage one another and build each other up just as you are in fact doing. Because folks, all of our best work happens when we build each other up instead of tearing each other down. Best thing about Kentuckians is our compassion and our kindness. It's what our union members like you are known for, lifting people up and fighting for what is right. This is such an exciting time for our state. And I'm not just talking as governor, but as a dad. Like every parent, I want Kentucky to offer every possible opportunity for your kids and for mine so they don't feel like they have to leave home to live the lives they want and pursue their dreams. Because of your hard work keeping our economic momentum going, we are closer to making that a reality than we have ever been. Together, we aren't just talking about building a better Kentucky. We're doing it. Thank you all for letting me send this message and enjoy the dinner.